So, I know y'all been wondering, where has David been? Where has David been? But guys, David's been working really, really hard. I've been grinding. Boy, it's been grinding out here, guys. Boy, it's been grinding. Tell me a little bit about the car, David. Oh, okay. it's a 03 Nissan 300. Oh, how about this? Yes, yes. Oh, my God. My car. <laughs> my car misses me. No, it's a 03 350Z. It's boring. It is a uh, stick ship, as you can tell, I'm rolling. Uh, I got a 370 uh, wheel specs on it right now. Previous owner did that. We're gonna need some new uh, tires pretty soon. Some Yokohamas on it, eh? Yeah. Dope, dope, it's dope. It's in great condition, to be honest, for what I got it for. I got it for a steal. I'm not gonna say numbers, but definitely it was a steal. Uh, the only problem it has really is the timing chain tensioner. Okay. It's, it's rattling right now, so um, like that, that's a big problem, but also a small problem because it can decide to jump anytime, it can decide to break, and there goes my motor. Yeah. But you know, I'm risking it for you guys. Hey. That's what it's, about. it's all about the limitless, bro. Limitless, bro. We're Push limitless. It, pushing it to the limit, bro. Uh, pushing it to the limit for sure. Let's see the interior, bro. Let's definitely check out the interior. So yeah, the interior um, needs work. <laughs> <laughs> Leather seats need to be redone, but... Leather seats, heated seats, electric seats. I got some Nismo merch in there. By the way, um, he did tell me he got a radio, although it just needs to be installed. So uh, don't uh, don't judge him on that. <laughs> but interior pretty good. What's the mileage like? 80,000 on the, oh, that's another thing I forgot to mention. So, previous owner swapped the motor from a G35, an 05 G35, and uh, that has 80,000 miles on it. Um, that's basically the specs under the hood. Um, Aftermarket intake. I'll pop the hood for you guys right now. I got an air duct right here, carbon fiber air duct, just to funnel some air in, you know. Nothing special. And that's the G35 motor. I don't have a cover on it. Definitely looks like the the motor I got. Yeah, it's the same exact motor. Awesome, awesome, yeah, awesome. Same exact motor. And for those who don't know what we're talking about with the tensioner, it's basically this. Ah, oh, it's really hot. <laughs> it's basically this right here. There's like a chain that kind of just works throughout the motor, and uh, I think there's something wrong with it, right? Yeah. I think there's something broken so inside. The little bearing inside the tensioner, it's uh, it busted. So now the chain is just rattling got it got it rattling so it is dangerous running the car like this but we aren't going to be pushing the car extremely yeah. hard or uh doing anything crazy right there I'm right now placing it in a few days i'm gonna actually do the whole uh timing system and everything awesome system. awesome and you can tell we already have the aftermarket uh cold air intake is that something you want to leave in there might replace uh, later on it for now yeah for now it's uh it came like that we just gonna did it i was gonna add one anyways I still need to add the strut tower, the bar across, you know. Mm -hmm. it. One of the things that I one thing that I noticed compared to mine is that he's running aftermarket headlights. I believe you told me you're not a big fan of them, are you? No, nah, I'm not really. I mean, the only reason why I don't really like them is because they're want to be halos. They're not really <laughs> halos. <laughs> but eh, it's whatever. Yeah, she's definitely definitely nice though. I sort of have the same problem as Carlos. My driver's side <laughs> works, but my passenger side doesn't work, so I gotta open it from the inside. And it's like I said, this is a common issue with Nissan, unfortunately. Everything's plastic. The engineers weren't very smart creating these door handles, so that's something we're gonna have to replace for his door handle and also my door handle. Yeah. I told him, I had asked him, I was like, bro, let's switch door handles so my driver's side could work and his passenger side could work. He told me no. <laughs> But yeah, so right now he's gonna go ahead and give it a wash. We're gonna get some nice shots at it and uh, let's get it going. Let's get it. $1.25. Yeah. That's bougie, bro. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah, that's bougie, bro. This is me by the zoo. <laughs> by the way, if you haven't checked out the video, this is Charles. He's gonna be a new member of the Limitless Garage. If you haven't checked out his channel, we'll put his link down in the description. So make sure you check him out, Charles. Got the 5.0 now, part of the, the Limitless group. It's awesome, man. We're adding to the group slowly, slowly, and uh, we might get one more driver later on in the future.
behind the scenes of Charles TV. Make sure you check it out. Link down below. Link down below. David, you want to tell them what you did? Shout out to David. What's up, guys? So basically, I just got this car. So yeah, one of the things that we want to do is uh, definitely grow our channel, definitely grow our uh, car group. We discussed a lot about basically getting another member for Limitless Garage, just so we have more of a variety for people to watch, you know, just so it's not just strictly imports and stuff like that, you know, there's there's now we have a Mustang a part of the group and it allows people to check out the variety of what we have. So we had to go ahead and uh we got we had to go ahead and put Charles in and definitely uh one of the things that we talked about was David getting his three fifty, so that's the dopest thing about it so shout out to david for that shout out to charles for joining the group man this is awesome with the boy charles tv knows it's ritual for limitless garage to go ahead and grab some cold ones so now that we got a new member a part of limitless garage we gotta go get my man a cold one we gotta go grab it we gotta go grab one right now hey y'all grabbing cold ones I'm gonna grab cold one. let's go get some cold ones ah the cold ones pick your poison my guy oh, yeah. pick your poison they told me i gotta grab one okay <laughs> It's ritual, man. It is ritual. <laughs> so we pulled up to the gas station because Charles needs to gas up and David needs to gas up 350 before we head to the event. So right now, we're headed to the event. Yo, you're supposed to crack it for the boys, bro. You forgot to I'm about to do that. <laughs> for the boys, bro. For the boys. <laughs> Let me get mine for the boys. This is for all my dogs. Out there, all my boys. Oh, yeah for the boys. We got to cheers up, we got to cheers up. Yep. So now we're just going to gas up and head out. We should be there after this. I cracked them already. We cracked them already, bro. Already. We cracked them for the boys already, bro. <laughs> for the boys? I wasn't even, you weren't even there. No. The boys weren't even there. Hey, hey oh, the cracked right here, bro. Hey, y'all won't do it like uh like those college students where they and then just no, I, I want I want it. I want it. <laughs> hey, who's that for, bros? Who's that for? The boys. That's for the boys. All right. Hey, bro. In bacon, recover. Nice shirt, dog. I appreciate it. Nice shirt. You supporting the team? I like it. Yeah, hey, we gotta get my man one though. We gotta get my man a t-shirt. Very soon. Very very soon. Hey. But the 350. That's amazing. That's amazing. Not to mention a Mustang in the group. So we just arrived to the Alamo Raceway track and uh, it's still kind of dead right now. It's not much going on, but cars are lining up and there are some races going on. But right now we're about to pay and we should be in after this. Yeah, so we just pulled up right now. We're going to go ahead and uh, check out some of the cars and then we're going to go ahead and take a seat out there and uh, watch some of the races and film some of them. Nine. 
So, that's team four, S14, his name is Layden, and uh, on Instagram his name is Lifestyle S14. And, like he's known all over Instagram on pages and whatnot. Like, well, I basically introduced myself. He introduced himself too, and uh, just you know, gave us some basic information about the car. And, well, about the engine too. Right? Yeah, it's RB25. When we asked him if he uh, like drifts it or races or anything, he said I would, but the engine itself is an RB25, which so is legal. not really not legal in the states. <laughs> find an uh, R33 as, as, as you know you don't see those in the states very often so he said you want to keep it just the way it is and just make it nice and he's doing a very good job on that yeah slap boy yo this evo y'all see this evo right here bro hey bro evo that evo will whoop you bro <laughs> oh running the hey running the volks I got the Brimbos. Those are replicas. Yeah. Nah, to be honest, like an Evo engine is a lot stronger than a Subaru's engine. Even though I want a Subaru, it'll swallow you, bro. We'll just leave it at that. It, it wouldn't swallow, swallow, would swallow me, but <laughs> it beat me. It no, it swallow you. I got homie in the red. I got homie in the red. Homie in the red. What do you think, Charles? What do you got? I got red. You got the helmet on. You got the helmet on? Alright, man. We're going with the red. No, it's serious. Who won? I wasn't paying attention. The red? Alright. That's gonna be me. Red's me. Blue is you. I mean, you think you got that twisted, bro. Think you got that twisted, bro. I see. 111 miles an hour while the left lane goes 1404 at 98. It did, didn't it? <laughs> but it happened? It slipped my life. What happened? I guess he's gonna make a buy right. What happened, bro? I don't know if it fell off. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're parked over there. I don't know if you want to park with us, but it's, no, it's cool. Yeah. Um, All right, guys. So the video that you just checked out was filmed a couple of weeks ago. Unfortunately, the outro that we filmed for that video got deleted somehow, mysteriously. My, somehow. My mistake. But um, we hope you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't already joined the family, go ahead and give us a like and subscribe. And remember, the possibilities are limitless. limitless. Alright guys, so the video that you just watched right now was filmed. <laughs> what are you doing <laughs> with that ball, bro? Put it back. Put that Come back. on, dog. Oh, right, show them that real quick. Fuck it. Look at this. What is How that? How do you not play with that? that what is, is this? That, my friend, is... Dragon Balls. That's, that's art. You need not break my balls? Come on, dog. Alright, you're very fragile. Alright. <laughs>